Hey Wargamers, Doug here with 2 Plus Tough, and it is that time again. We're doing another lore contest. In case you missed the last one, here's basically how it works. Essentially, uh, I open up a special email address where people can submit their content, and there's descriptions down below about how to do that. Uh, and then I take them, I read through them all, I pick out my best 10 that I can find, I show those 10 to my YouTube members as well as my patrons over on Patreon. They pick the top five, places one, two, three, get prizes, and then all five of those videos that they choose get dedicated lore videos as if they were a real part of Age of Sigmar lore, and honestly, why can't they be? So last year we had a ton of fun with this. It was a great time, there were some incredible stories. The one uh, bit of feedback that I got from folks was that it was a bit too broad, right? Last time it was just anything in the mortal realms and, and people kind of struggled with that. It helps to have some kind of narrative lead. And so for this time, it's going to be set in Gur, Realm of Beast. Your story must be set there or it must be about, you know, characters from Gur, something like that. It has to be very Gurish. Based on the feedback of many, many people, the word count has been increased from 1,500 to 2,500 words to tell your story, but I will be extremely strict on that. If you don't follow the rules in the description down below, instant disqualification, I just have to. There's just so many people. I think I got 230 entries last time. It's a lot to read through, especially if I'm increasing the word count. So kind of bear with me on that one. Okay, so the actual rules here, I got it written down here. Uh, 2,500 word count maximum. It must be set in the realm of Gur or have some you know setting meaningful about being Gur. Don't just tell me your story and the last you know couple words are, oh, and this happened in Gur, right? Make it a part of the actual story. Most importantly, do not put your name in the entry. I know it's very tempting to put like, you know, Doug Griggs at the top and then your story. Don't do that. The reason is my patrons are also going to be contributing and I like to have that level of anonymity. So I will know who it's from based on your email address and I'll be able to reach out to you in case you, you know, advance to the next level, something like that. Um, but don't put your email or your name anywhere inside the actual document. I accept Google Docs as well as Microsoft Word. And I'm gonna have entries open at the email address down below from now, the time this video goes live, until January 1st. So you can use that break you get for your holidays to kind of just reset and get your story cranked out. Give me a week or so for me to read through them all and then the patrons will see, oh sorry, our patrons and YouTube members will see the top 10 and then I'll do voting and polls and stuff like that and kind of collate all that data together. A couple things that are important. One, um, I'm not a grammar, you know, a, dictator or anything like that. I, I'm not the best writer myself. So if you are someone who doesn't speak English um, and you're, you're kind of worried or concerned that that's going to disqualify you, just go ahead and submit it anyway. Uh, you know, grammatical stuff we can always work on. When I do my lore video, I'll, I'll talk with you to make sure we got stuff clear. But really, it's the concept. It's, it's enjoying the fantasy setting for what it is. So without further ado, let's talk about the prizes for this year. So for first place, we have a $100 Games Workshop gift card. That's USD, no matter where you are. Everything has to be digital, kind of, because it just makes it so much easier during this season uh, of basically of world history. Uh, second place is a one month free Audible credit. So if I, eventually a free book, essentially, is how that goes. And the uh, third year is a one subscription, one year, sorry. <laughs> Third place is a one year subscription to AOS Reminders, which is a great database for helping you get better as a gamer and kind of making sure you know all your rules and you don't miss a single thing. Everyone had a great time with this last year. I had a wonderful time for sure. And it really does help to have these cool stories in the background that we can pull and pick from, especially when kind of releases get a little slow, which sometimes they do with Games Workshop, especially with all the production issues that are happening globally. Now. If you have questions, I have a running FAQ in the description down below. So before you ask, go ahead and make sure the question hasn't been answered already. If you ask a question that's new, I will copy paste it into the FAQ so that people can see it. But it's, it's very straightforward, right? Write up your thing in a email, or not email, in a uh, Word doc of some kind. Send it to me at the email address below. Make sure your name's not in it. It's really that simple. So friends, thank you so much for joining me. Good luck to all the contestants, and I look forward to seeing what you guys have, uh, your vision of Gur could possibly be. Now, this could be an army that you have built set there, or it could be just a story that takes place there. Up to you, surprise me. I'll check you out later. Happy Wargaming.